Howdy folks, welcome to another THSS Tech Lab video. Hope you're all subscribing. Today, we're gonna learn how to open Adobe Illustrator. Pretty simple. Uh, let's get started. So, we're gonna go to our start menu of our computer. You can start typing in Illustrator and it'll pop up there. Just click on it there. Now, as it's opening, let me explain a little bit about Adobe Illustrator. Uh, you might be used to be using uh, Photoshop. Uh, but Adobe Illustrator works differently than Photoshop. Illustrator is a, a vector drawing program. So it is going to be mathematically constructing images rather than uh, making them out of pixels. That'll make more sense as we go. But just know that whatever objects you create in Illustrator can be sized up and down almost infinitely. But because they're mathematical images, uh, they're not going to behave like they do in Photoshop. So it is uh, you're going to use different tools than Photoshop. So the first thing you're going to do when it pops open here is create a new file. You can do that by heading over here to the File button, hitting New, File, New, or hitting Control N. You can see the shortcut keys are up there. We're going to create a new file. Uh, there are lots of different options up here, but I'm going to show you how to create a poster, which is going to be one of our first images, first assignments. And we're going to head down here and convert this to inches because we can make it a, a canvas size of something we know what it is. So I'm going to make it, call it poster here, call it poster one. Sure. Uh, I like the size 18 inches by 24 inches. It's really important that you have this in inches though and not in pixels or points or even centimeters. It would be too small for, to work with. So you want this in inches. And then you don't have a lot of other options. You can't set DPI or anything like that because again, these are vector images and not uh, pixel-based ones. So let's hit create there. Pops up a canvas for us. I'll teach you shortcut keys of how to zoom in and move around in another video, but I'm gonna uh, just zoom in a little bit. And then I'm gonna do, uh, I'm gonna change my workspace here with this little down arrow here to a painting layout. That's a generally easier one to use. Uh, I can see colors on the side with a painting layout and uh, some brushes and some layers. Some of the stuff you may be familiar with from Photoshop might uh, be here. Uh, I find the painting layout more useful than the other uh, default essentials layout um, which you don't need to use. So we have our, our layout all set now. And now if I wanted to create a line just using this line tool over here, I can change it, I can make it bigger, change the stroke. Again, I'll teach you some stuff later about that, but this is a very simple introduction video. Um, I'm going to now save my awesome line that I've made. And of course, where are you going to save it? What's that? Your folder. That's correct. So let's go into your folder here in the Z drive like we always do. And uh, we're going to go find your folder. It's probably in one of these folders over here. You know that, but I have my own folder, of course, here. And I can save it as poster one. I'll just leave it as the default for now and hit save. I'll pop up this little thing. This, you can just use the defaults here and save it. And that's it. That's the end of our video. Remember to hit subscribe. Talk to you later.